Please, God, remove me from this life and place me in another world where I rule supreme. In a world where everyone dies when I look at them, and everyone leaves me alone when I want to play my online gaming. Hmm. Ritsuka is so smexy when he prays. What is love? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Okay, seriously, Sobi, why the hell do you keep following me? Oh, my naive Ritska. I'm a pedophile. Stalking is what I do best. Well, you suck at it. Go take a picture of some Iromote cat or I'll report you to child services. Very well. No, it's not very well. It's impossible. <laughs> well, geez, it's someone's time of the month. I'm out of here, but remember, I'll always be watching. Man, I love painting depressing pictures of butterflies. Hey, So-chan! Kyo, how the hell did you get in my house? That's not important. What is important is that I'm here and there's one bed. Whatever, I'm leaving. And, Kyo? Yeah? Get a life. You'll never be half the stalker I am. Ah, uh, Sammy. Even though you're not dead, I'd like to pretend you are for mom's sake. She'll have an egg if she figures out you're still alive. Good morning, anyway. Here, drink up. Meaningless aggression solves all of my problems! Mom? What are you looking at? I'm going to fork you good! Mom? It's my helpful rage throwing bag that is supposed to be my son! Here we go. You're a boring person whether I'm around or not. Look at you, having meaningless flashbacks. Wow, you just make me feel so warm inside. What? Well, well, what do we have here? Jam? Here we go, you know the rules. Jam is banned in this school for no adequately explained reason. Hey, that's not fair. God, this stuff looks like sh anyways. Jesus. Let's play a stupid game kids our age shouldn't play because we're too old for it. Hot potato! You're so slow, Yuriko. Only Ritzka could say that to me. <gasps> Yuriko's homemade jam? Homemade? As in, she was touching it with her hands? After touching herself? I want to eat Yuriko's va- I mean, jam. Her jam. I want to eat her jam. You know, Yuiko, stupid people don't get what they want, bringing in pointless bullies like us. Hey, pizza face, give me that jam. Swipe? Yes, the jam is mine. So, Yuiko, can I eat your jam? And by jam, I mean... Give that back pillow biter. <laughs> Shut the hell up, Yuiko. Yeah, go cry and dump. What is this? What the f is this? Nobody treats Yuiko like crap but me. Ritska, what are you talking about? Yuiko is my bitch. And for trying to take my place and treat her like crap, I'm gonna get so to rape you all! What? Ritska, what kind of emo kid threatens to have someone raped? Some pretty messed up kid, huh? Wait... Listen, Yuiko, you can't be trying to pretend people hate you. But, what they really do? I'd hate you too if I was your age, but do you see me complaining? No... That's
That's right. But Ritzka will help me. I love him so much. <laughs> Good luck with that. Hey, Loveless. Come with us. We gotta talk. No. Here, Ritzka. Have a frappuccino. It's really tasty. Why are you giving me treats? So you'll protect us from Sobi. I'll take these two to my van by the ravine. <laughs> he tried to touch us inappropriately. I'm scared now. We're heading out of town. You should do. For some reason that makes me very angry. Oh, whatever. Just keep Sobi away from us, eh? No. God, I see that a lot. Somehow I'm going to be convinced to do that because some damn Houdini is behind the script. Here we go. How do you get- I smelled your frappuccino from a block away, and since I starved, I've come here to take it from the person who has it, but it's you! Yes, you we go. Have it. I think, I think it's spiked, spiked anyway. anyway. Oh well, oh well. she'll test, test it. it. Wow, it tastes like drugs! How, How dull. dull. Because everyone in this series revolves around Ritzka, I don't see why I'm not a bigger part of it. That's why I'm searching to actually enter the plot in this episode. Miss Shinonome. A very hot guy. He has to be taken or gay. Hmm, how old are you? I'm, uh, 23. <coughs> 23, eh? Three years older than me. Eh. Too bad for her I'm a pedophile, rendering her enormous breasts useless against me. Well, if you were, oh, ten years younger than me and a boy, maybe we would have a relationship. But you aren't. Actually, maybe you can hook me up with a few of your students. Sobe, what are you saying to my teacher? I was complimenting on her stupid ears and teasing her endlessly about her virginity. It hurts. God damn it, Sobe. I'm getting pretty sick of your shenanigans. Now apologize to my teacher. Hmm, fine. Miss Shinonome, I'm sorry you're a fugly old skink. <laughs> a total stranger insulted me. <laughs> Now that she's gone, I got you those pictures of that lame cat, thus killing most of my screen time in this episode. Huh? Sobi? What's that? It's a cat. This isn't a damn cat. It's a picture of that white animated cartoon character. Hello Kitty, to be more exact. We live in a fictional alternative universe of Japan where people have fucking ears and tails. And don't you love them? Like you'd know. Hmm? What happened to your tail and ears? I love you, Ritsuka. Professor Ritsu, we're out. Ow, oh, and what's that supposed to mean? Sobi tried to rape us. We aren't going to try to abduct Ritzka for you anymore. Breathless, you have failed me for the last time. I'm now going to dramatically choke you off screen. Yeah! <laughs> She is a mess, but also brave. My brother died when I was ten. My gosh, he eyed that gentleman. I'm just so emo. I hate all of my so-called friends. So please don't think that I'm a homo, or this is where it ends. <laughs>